What do you, what kind of tactics, what measuring tools do you use to test your hypothesis? Yeah, Apollo for the cold email. So can I share my screen or is, are you going to publish that on YouTube? I can, if you want to, yeah. Yeah, let me just uh, allow me to share my screen and I'll, I'll show you some systems yep. there. So folks, this is actually a great opportunity as well to let you folks know that, hey, we do have a YouTube channel. So please make free to check out the YouTube channel. Uh, and then you can also go ahead and uh, check out, go ahead and check out the Shades of E on YouTube. And you'll be able to actually see uh, these video clips as well as reels. So that's a great little plug there. Charles, let's see it. Yeah. So, okay. Apollo.io, right? Um, let's see what account that is. Yeah, so that's a client's account. So I need to log out of there. Apollo.io, guys, basically 100 bucks a month gives you 10,000 contacts and it's a cold email tool, Mike, right? A lot of people ask me, what's the difference between this and HubSpot or MailChimp? These tools, they don't accept cold email. You really need to use a tool like Apollo, connect it with SendGrid, which is super important. SendGrid is 20 bucks a month. That will allow you to reach email scale. So to your question, you know, like me, I just go in my sequences and there you'll see my trove of chaos and magic to me, which is like all the, the campaigns that I deployed. It takes a good time to load because there's so many in there. Uh, but as you can see at the bottom, there's 374 campaigns on this account. I have multiple and there's multiple uh, tests going on here. Uh, a lot of it is like the podcast, right? So basically you can see here uh, private equity um, podcast, for example, um, government nonprofits, you know, so I get my data by talking to all of these folks and I get more ideas. And then I, I start campaigns on Apollo again um to test out these ideas ai agencies some are direct offers like hey do you want to start your podcast and so forth as you can see all the open rates are pretty high and the reply rate everything's over 2.5 percent um so i get lots of responses and you'll see some bigger campaigns you know with a lot of uh contacts added let's take uh this one here uh ceos you know 4.5k active so this stuff, it just scales. And then I get like all these replies in my mailbox, like not interested. This guy here is like, yeah, share me the details. So what I do, I just reply here and modify his name and I send, you know, so that's the offer of the podcast funnel. It's, it's a big email, but I've AB tested and people like that. I also mentioned my price, uh, upfront in these emails so that people don't waste my time because I've got, um, I'm in a specific situation, right? Like most people, they need to follow up. Uh, most people, they don't mention the prices because they really want to talk to people. Me, me, I'm overbooked, you know, like um, my, my calendar looks like this year. And my, again, my calendar takes time to load because it's just craziness. Um, it looks like this. That's my average week. So basically, wow. I, I don't want to speak to folks that are not sure like of my prices and so forth. Like I just want to get it over with. So to answer your question again, everything is super centered on Apollo.io um, and just the search feature so that folks can understand here. Uh, let's say I want family offices, right? CEOs of family offices. Well, here I already made up a search. I just click on it and the title will be CEOs will be founders and then I use I can use the keyword and I can basically research anyone anywhere in the world um for that regard. So yeah, that's my little laboratory here.